All right, so we have two choices. We go out to the island. Oh, okay, so the charge boots were the bonus there. And then the two islands are the terminals we have to get. All right, let's go to the island one because it seems like the less final feeling one. Kind of gets us the opportunity to play with our new toys. Okay, they do have a time limit. That is good to know. Oh, hello, mothership. Oh, okay. That's not cool. So it's only there to blow up the fan thingies. All right. I'm good with that. Ow, that was dumb. Oh, we can warp in from outer out from uh, subspace. That's lovely. I'll just take the shortest route I can to my goal. Ow! Did it again. Okay, so this looks like it's just back and forth and back and forth, which means there's a good chance there's a hidden bolt on that island over there. Okay, I'm getting really annoyed at this little mothership thing. Was oh, this thing auto-activating platforms for me? No, it's not. Hmm. Is there something secret back now? Okay. It was felt there felt like a weird little thing because I skipped over one of those sets of platforms, but I guess that's just my skill. Ow, jackass! Fine, I'll step on your little platform so you can blow them up again. Jeez. Some people need to be fulfilled in life. Yeah, go back to subspace. Leave me alone. Don't like the fact that there's an ammo vendor right here. That looks very boss platforming. Oh, boy. Alright. See what we got. Hey, we got a sight round against the mothership. Alright, so it can't hurt me too much. If I plan my shield strikes, I'm fine. behind the shield and keep throwing turrets. Keep throwing turrets off the edge. Already up to tier three. All right, what's tier three do? Love when weapons level up quickly. Absorbs enemy projectiles. After absorbing some of the shots, the shield will discharge an energy shot to any nearby enemies. Yeah, so it's now vampiric and bullet absorbing. Okay, I'm actually very, very low on health. I was unaware of this, so we're just gonna... Oh, 
Oh yeah, we did not do a lot of damage to this thing. Okay, now we're doing damage to it. I do like the damage indicator ring. I kind of like that. That's a cool thing on the actual lock-on. Makes it a lot easier than looking in that bottom corner of the map. Or on the bottom part of the screen. I like how now I'm getting serious. Oh, uh, we almost had it there. Boom! Down you go! Not totally exhausted by that fight at all. Now, don't kill myself with the explosive crate in the pursuit of the health crates. Good. Check it out. Looks like somebody's a big fan of Courtney Gears. Courtney who? Come on, remember that bombshell handing out prizes on Annihilation Nation? Ah, yes. Her specifications were remarkable. <laughs> yeah. Well, she's not the hottest pop star in the galaxy because of her singing. That is odd. It appears this computer was recently used to edit one of her music videos. Oh, let's watch it! I, I mean, you know, it may contain a clue or something. Genocide in a pop song. <laughs> hmm. Miss Gears may be in league with Dr. Nefarious. Yeah, who knew? She always seems so sweet and innocent in her videos. Well, except for that one with the... You know what I mean? <clears throat> she might possess information about what Nefarious is planning. Oh, right. And if we win that grand prize on Annihilation Nation, we'll get another chance to talk to her. Yay, we're going back to the arena. Now, there was a... Yeah, there's... That has to be to another bolt. You don't just have random platforms like this in the back for nothing. Yeah, I see the bolt. My loot senses knew something was wrong. Are these platinum or titanium? I don't remember which ones these ones were. Titanium. How are we doing on them? We found 10. 30 are left to find. Not too bad. We got the hacker. We got the magna plate armor. And we have two of apparently five episodes of the comic. Alright. Oh, we still have the inside of the base to infiltrate. We can't go back and do the Annihilation Nation just yet. So we will tackle the inside of the base when we come back. Alright guys, welcome back to Ratchet & Clank. Took a little break. And now we're going to take on the inside of the secret base lab thing. Which, honestly, like, that is an awesome looking secret lab. It's like a whole city worth. Really 
fill back up our ammo before we head anywhere. Uh, still can't afford that. Yeah, maybe I should get the Spitting Hydra. Just don't feel like I'm going to be using it too, too much. I don't know. Oh, hello, robot guards. Oh, I need some health. Puppies, go get them. Nicely done, puppies. Give me all your HPs. Oh, wow, these shields are huge now, too. They still level up really, really quickly. Yes, the turret glove finally leveled up. What's it do? What's it do? What's it do? Increased explosive damage. Oh shit, those boxes actually can break. I did not know that. Congratulations to employee JX34 on his promotion to Killbot First Class. Aww, congratulations. Killbot First Class, that's a hell of an accomplishment. He should be very proud. Death by puppy! Death by puppy again! Death by even more puppies! My puppies have a learning issue with, you know, running into walls. Mmm, give me that extra HP back. Oh, there's my other puppy. What do you do when you little playful scamp? There is a lot of guys up here. I do like the breakable cover system. Like, a lot of games of this era did not have a, like, partially destructible cover system. Ages of Doom, they leveled up. What'd they get? What'd they get? What'd the puppies get? Poise A, squad of four, with the portable laser cannon. Once the cannon is out of ammo, the agents will seek out and attack. <gasps> that means the puppies will stay around longer. Oh, that's a turret. Awesome. Love my puppies. You flux rifle. Well, whoop, shit. What am I getting shot by? Oh, they're on the other side of that wall. Well, now that I have the opportunity, let's, uh, one here and one here. And puppies. Oh, they're so cute! They run around and shoot things. Go, my lovable puppy minions. Oh, they're so cute with their little laser guns on their heads. Look at him. Oh, he's so happy. Who's got a cute little laser? Who's gonna slaughter daddy's enemies? Hey, come down, boys.
Nicely done. Oh, these guys are great. And they hang around for a lot longer now since they're not instantly killing themselves, which is great. Oh, look at them causing chaos. So adorable. Oh, I think they're going just out of range. Okay, shield. Agent Doom. And some turrets. Aww, but why can't you use the Office Computer Network for online gaming? It's the best kind of gaming. Okay, so I have a choice. I can go over that way. Or I can go down the secret way that probably has a platinum bolt at the end of it. Eh, it has health. I'll take health. Secret platform down below. Nope. Meh, health is fine. Okay, out of Agents of Doom, so it's gonna be swing over and then deploy a turret. Or I can deploy the health draining shield, which actually seems to work just as well. Ah, but it doesn't drain health if I'm not damaged. Well, I'm just got damaged, so. Thank you. Ah, I don't have to break my own boxes anymore. And it's hacking time. Nice. Grab, kill, 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 grab, 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 kill, grab, kill, kill, grab, grab, kill, kill, grab, grab. They are getting harder, I'll give them that. But I think it's more of it just taking longer to complete that makes it harder, rather than it actually being too much more intense. Those shields are going to get annoying eventually, though. Yeah. Kind of like that. I wonder how the infector works on these guys. Actually, fairly well. Okay, so they can't be hit with the Infector twice. That's actually probably a pretty good defense mechanism. Security breach in Sector 5. All units respond. Way behind me. Are you interested in a career in the exciting fields of building security, execution, or VCR repair? Visit the job fair on level two. Wow, execution and VCR repair? Yeah, that's like my two best skills. Alright, um.
Warning! Intruders appears to be armed with lava! Bring your s'mores. Alright, so there's a button there, and there's the hacker. Oh, wait a second. I think I know what the button does. Let's get my scope out. It opens that outside door, and there's a platinum bolt out there. How do I... how do I sprint jump again? There we go. Shit! Oh, come on! I forgot I had the charge boots. Yeah, charge boots would have helped a lot there. You can control them now? Best thing ever. Hey guys, what's shaking? My order of Casual Fridays have been canceled indefinitely. Lava for everybody. Lava! 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 Ooh, we're about to level up. Grenade! And there is the titanium bolt. Nice. And some HP to help recover all of the mu HP we lost while recovering that bolt. I'm glad I picked up those charge boots. I thought this little pathway seemed a little suspicious. Also, the mysterious button had to do something. trying to do that just by continuously spinning in a circle and then just hitting the right button as it went by. Which is actually a lot harder than you think because the speed of the gun does not match the speed of the rotation of the cylinder. Done. Lava gun. I don't really have much other. Hey, let's level with the nitro launcher a bit. Hey guys. Bye guys. Intruder detected in sector nine. All units terminate with extreme prejudice. Ooh, hello. Mysterious shiny box it. Inferno power. Suck it, all of you. I'm immune to damage! Inferno power! Congratulations to employee JX34 on his promotion to Killbot First Class. Wow, one of you survived. I'm impressed. I would kill you with a puppy if I could. Oh, 
would shoot you in the head with a turret. Phase to explore some of these side areas. Holy crap, that was a ton of boxes. Ooh, we might be able to afford that Annihilator soon. Oh, more hacking. Not that I don't enjoy the minigame, it's just... Does every door have to be hacked? Well, I guess it is a secure secret base facility, so I guess I would be critiquing his security if I didn't have to hack every door. Damn it. Ah! <sighs> My first failure at it. That was just like, remove the top layer of red, and then just absorb everything at the end there. I'm like super focused when I'm doing this too. There we go. No, oh, damn it. Ah! Okay, at least it lets me repeat just these stages. So once I get past one, I'm checkpointed past that one. Oh, that was getting close. Yeah, so I said these were going to get harder, and they got harder. Now, it's okay if I let a code bit pass me. It's just not okay if I hit the red bit, so if I focus on just defense and let some of the greens pass, then I'm just losing opportunity. This terminal should give us high-level access to all of Nefarious's project files. I found something. Death Star! I am afraid it does not look good. Bio-obliterator? Huh. I see what you mean. What exactly does it do? That information has been deleted. Uh -oh. Well, the name well, kind of explains it. Where is this thing? Location unknown. However, a large transport vessel left this facility yesterday. It was headed for the Obani moon system. That's no the Obani moon. moons, huh? Well, we better check it out. Anything else secret in here? Secrets. Nope, back to the ship. Can we afford things now? Not quite. Alright, well, I think this is a good point to stop for now. Let me take a break, and I will see you next time on Ratchet & Clank, Up Your Arsenal.